زي ما كنت بنوه انا وكريم في بدايه الحلقه هيكون معانا كابتن فاتس موسيماني هو دلوقتي معانا على التليفون عشان نتعرف منه برضو على بعض النقاط الخاصه بالمباراه امس والفتره القادمه مستر فاتس جود مورنينج هابي تو هاف يو وذ اس ان اور شو جود مورنينج جود مورنينج ايفري بودي جود مورنينج تو يور فيورز اولسو ثانك يو فور هافينج مي اون يور شانل First, I want to congratulate you. Congratulations. A good score. But let me ask you, was it a good match and performance from the players as well? Um, I, uh, it depends how you look at it from, from, from us on the technical side, on the coaching side. Um, I, I was happy with the results because it's important that Allahni must go to the group stages uh, because If, if we want to win the Champions League for the third time in a row, we must go to the group stages, and we have achieved that. The second part that is important is to win the game, and we have won the game. And mm -hmm. the third part is um, convincing to win the game, yes, because he scored six goals. Uh, and it's the first time I six goals here. Yes. You know, and before the match, and the whole training, the whole week, I was speaking to the players, I said, We need to score more than five goals because normally when you go to three goals, sometimes you score three goals in the first half and you stop scoring. So I, I was a little bit tough on them that we need to score the six goals the whole week and um, more than six goals to be honest. But we got six, okay, seven in aggregate. Uh, I think that's that's more important. But what is uh, what I'm not happy with? I was not happy yesterday with the match. Because we played below our standards, mm. that's not the way we need to play. Um, if you look at the results, you say, okay, um, the score was good. Uh, it means we were dominating. Yes, we dominate, but with the principles of how I want the team to play, we didn't play very well. I'm not happy with the performance mm. uh, because you can't see with your own eye. But according to some of the things that we've been training mm. and we've been practicing, I'm not happy with the performance. But also. There are also uh, positives out of the performance. Uh, there are a lot of things that uh, we've been practicing. Mm -hmm. And I don't want to say much because uh, everybody will be listening to what I'm saying and we'll be checking how how we play. But we have, we have, we have improved a little bit of way of playing somewhere, somehow, mm -hmm. on our check. And we got that yesterday a lot. Um, but unfortunately, uh, it, it's not exactly what I want. But I'm getting frustrated because I've been working on it for the last last five days. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, can I go to the another point? You had a serious talk with the players on the halftime yesterday, and you seemed a little bit angry. Could you explain us more and what happened? What did you tell the players on the halftime, please, Mr. Petzo? No, I was a little bit angry. You're right. Did you see my body language uh, on on the pitch yesterday? I was uh, I never even had one smile. You know, because um, I, 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 I like the team to play together as a team. And somewhere, somehow, I, I found some things that uh, did not make us to play like a good team, like a, a team, brotherhood, you know, we need to, to play together, uh, not to play as individuals, yeah. you know. So, so those are some of the things. And, uh, and also, there's no reason for us to concede a goal against a team like that. There's no reason. Mm. To be honest, there's no reason to consider goals. So we, we played the last two games, we considered two goals, you know? So there's, there's, there's loopholes we need to improve. We mm. should not look at six goals. Football is about defense and attack. So uh, we, have, we need to, to, to do well. Uh, the first two games when we played um, NP and we played uh, 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 we lost the Super Super Cup. Mm -hmm. We have improved on our defense. We didn't concede a goal. We lost the goal, the, the Super Cup, with the penalties. And even when we played NP, we didn't concede a goal. Now, now we're back to conceding goals again. Mm -hmm. So that makes me very, very unhappy. Yes. Uh, I'm not going to you know, ask you too many questions. I will end my questions. I don't know if Karim has I another do, yes. one. Yes. I want to ask about Mohamed Mahmoud. Many were expecting that he will start playing from the beginning of the match, but he did not play. Could you just tell us why? Yeah, because people don't know what's happening in training. You, you must understand. Mm. People talk from, from, from watching TV. People talk from watching the match in, in the 
coffee shop or, or wherever, people say have their own opinion and they have the right to have their own opinion. Mm -hmm. And people know Mahmoud as a very good football player, which I think is a very good football player. He's, he's an unbelievable player, to be honest. So good, so good. But uh, people don't know the condition, his condition, his physical condition is not very good. Mm -hmm. So he needs to work hard. He has, he has missed about a year or two not playing football. Okay. And, and he needs to, 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 he knows, he knows, he knows, he knows. He needs to work a bit harder okay. to, to, to come into the team and needs to, he needs to fight. Yes, we didn't have enough players on the bench because um, uh, we didn't have, uh, I mean, that's beyond our, 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 our uh, what can we do when the, when the Egyptian Federation finished uh, the league later on the registration of the camp. Mm. You've you got to understand that. Uh, and I hope uh, this does cousin I mean, it's an internal problem for internal clubs and also for, for the Amalek, also for, for, for Pyramid. Yes. We need to improve our program because we're playing with uh, uh, teams that have new players that have been signed, but we don't have new players. So this can be a problem for, 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 for our teams. Because if, if Pyramid did not win yesterday, because they can't have the new players, it's a problem for, for Egyptian football. So we need to look at football uh, in a holistic way. We need to support the, the local teams. The federation must support and help us. Great. Okay, good morning, Mr. Bissouani. Thank you so much for your time and thank you for being with us. This is such a great pleasure. Sabah al Sabah al -Nur. Sabah al -Nur. <laughs> So nice to, to have you with us in the show. And we hope to see you with us, I mean, in person one day. And this, this might be soon, I hope. Well, uh, inshallah, uh, <laughs> we will make the plan. We have, have been on your channel before, so we'll, we'll make a plan. The schedule is not helping us now, but uh, maybe later. Inshallah, maybe when inshallah. we have uh, the, the FIFA break, is the best time. Inshallah, inshallah. I think that expressing your unhappiness is so important, and I think that lots of fans would agree with that because you know, just winning sometimes is not very satisfactory for the fans and this makes me want to ask you about what are your expectations regarding the new season expectations for the new season yeah. we need to correct what went mm. wrong and i think you know what went wrong what went wrong we lost uh, the dowry yes we need to correct that and this was so and, sad from the people's point the of view of course. Super Cup, so we need we need we need uh, to correct that but uh, with the dowry, I always say that uh, we can also be said that we lost the dowry. But, but I always say, how do we lose the dowry? What happened? And, and it's important to check those things and say, what happened? Of course, of course you know? it is. So, so there are many factors that uh, affected us to not to win the dowry and not to make excuses. I don't like making excuses mm. or blaming referees or all those things. I never spoke about any referee or against any referee. I never spoke against any coach or anything. Yes, you I never did. You that. never did, of course. Yes. Well, yes, thank you. Know. Thank you so much for your time once again. Thank you, Mr. Petzl. Yeah, you. we wish. Uh, Have a good morning. Uh, we wish uh, Walid the speedy recovery and the president the speedy recovery. Hopefully, Hopefully. The, the win could could bring them something, feel, make them feel better. Inshallah, they'll come Inshallah. back. Inshallah. Inshallah. Goodbye. Have a great morning. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much, Baba. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, موضوع ايه؟ موضوع ايه؟ اه جدا يعني سريعا برضه خلينا نقول لحضراتكم اللي اتكلمنا فيه هو في الاول طبعا باركنا وكنت بساله يعني هو سكور نتيجه كويسه لكن مش هل حضرتك برضه بتعتقد اداء كويس وبرفورمانس من اللعيبه كمان هو قال بالظبط كده يعني انا سعيد بالنتيجه اول مره نحصل كمان على النتيجه ده نسجل ست اهداف هو كان متوقع ان هو يحقق خمسه حقق سته كمان فده شيء كويس جدا لكن غير راضي عن المستوى هو بيتكلم ان النتيجه مرضيه لكن غير راضي عن المستوى احنا ادائنا يعني افضل من ذلك وعشان كده انا سالته في الهاف تايم حضرتك اتكلمت مع اللعيبه وكان باين يعني انك متضايق فهل ده كان السبب ليه علاقه يعني فقال بالظبط احنا في كرات كتيره وكان في اداء لا كان ممكن نكون احسن بكتير واحنا ما عندناش رفاهيه ان احنا نخطا تاني او غيره لازم كل 
كل لاعب يكون يعني مركز كويس جدا فده كان الحوار ما بينهم الى حد ما وسالته عن برضو محمد محمود هو تحدث كده الناس يعني بتتكلم او ناس اه بتقول كان المفروض يشارك من البدايه لكن الناس ما تعرفش في التمرين ايه اللي حصل وفي تفاصيل ما يعرفوهاش هو الفكره كلها ان هو عايز كل لاعب يكون جاهز جدا وعلى قد المستوى علشان احنا لسه عندنا ماتشات كتيره جدا وبالنسبه لسؤالك انت كنت بتتوقع يعني على الاكسبكتيشن بالترتيب كده وعدنا انه ان شاء الله هيجي وينورنا يعني <تصفيق> بس مش حاليا يعني بس حاليا الجدول عندهم مزدحم جدا فان شاء الله في اقرب فرصه يكون ضيف اكيد هنسعد ونتشرف بوجوده معانا وسالته عن توقعاته فيما يتعلق بالموسم الجديد ان شاء الله اللي هو بصدد البدايه وقال نفس نفس تقريبا نفس المعنى اللي هو قاله ضمنيا في الاجابات اللي جاوبها على اسئله نهواند فكره ان هو من وجهه نظره ان ما كانش راضي خالص عن الاداء وانه كان شايف ان في الكثير من الاخطاء التي تستحق التوقف عندها وتصحيحها عشان ده ينعكس بالاجابه على الموسم الجديد وبتمنى له اكيد التوفيق بطبيعه الحال ان شاء الله الفتره اللي جايه تشهد والموسم الجديد يشهد يعني عوده مره اخرى للاداء اللي احنا دايما دايما طبعا. عارفينه للنادي الاهلي باذن الله تمام